<laughs> Hi Clever Cocoons, it's me, Miss Nikki. This is a really exciting week for me because at Dew and Glue, it's under the sea week and I love the ocean. I just think that there's so many exciting things in the ocean. Dolphins and whales, fish, mermaids. And how cool it, would it be to just explore the sea like as a pirate or to be a mermaid, which secretly would I hope. Anyway, so all kinds of exciting things happen under the sea and this week we're gonna get to experience it a little bit because we're gonna make aquariums. Do you know what an aquarium is? It's a big tank that your fish live in when they're your pets. You keep it at your house. You can see the fish inside because it's made of glass and you feed them and you have to keep it clean. Well, this one you're not gonna have to keep clean, but it is gonna be inspired by a real aquarium. So grab your pack and which pack do you think we're using this week? The one that says fish? Yes and it has a picture of a fish on the front? Yes, so okay, grab that one and let's get started. Oh, okay. So you should have your fish pack, it says fish. You also are gonna need your glue, you're gonna need your box of markers, and you're going to need your scissors. Let's see what's inside of here. Let's make sure you have all the little things that you're gonna need. So, did everything come out? No. Everything did not come out. So, you should have a plate, two little fish, two pieces of white ribbon. You should have a baggie that has some silver stickers in it. My stickers fell out of my baggie, but that's okay. All right, so let's get started. The first thing that we're going to do is prepare the back of the aquarium. So get your markers and decorate the aquarium however you think that an aquarium should look. I think that I'm going to use my green marker and I think I'm going to use my green marker and make some seaweed. Where seaweed is like grass except inside of the ocean. So I think that my aquarium would have that. Boom. There we go. Let's see. Let's make some more seaweed. You don't have to make seaweed though. You can draw fish. Maybe I'll draw a fish. Maybe I'll draw a a little purple fish in the background. You could draw the fish. He's just a little baby fish. Here we go. You could draw the fish. You can draw dolphins or mermaids. You can draw water. Let's make some water bubbles. I'm gonna make water bubbles. Okay, now get your little fish and decorate him however you want, S or her. So my fish, I think I'm gonna use my markers and I'm gonna make some little designs. He's gonna be blue. This one is gonna have some pink on it too. Pink polka dots, why not, it's my fish. This one is gonna have orange, one orange line, like Nemo, boom, 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 and an orange eye. And this one is gonna have a green eye. Boop. And they are both going to have a shiny star spot on them, because I want my fish to be shiny. So I'm just going to put one of my silver stickers on you, like that, and one on your little brother, like that. Okay, so once you have them decorated how you want, take your glue and add two drops of glue to the top of your plate. One, two. Ah, okay, that was a a bit more glue than I meant to use, but that's okay. 
and then glue on your ribbon. And then at the bottom of your ribbon, put another drop of glue. Make sure that you don't accidentally put glue on the plate because you don't want the ribbon to be stuck to the plate. You want it to move around, okay? And then I'm just going to glue my fish right there and glue my other one right there. There we go. Let everything dry and that's it. I can't wait to craft with you guys again next week. I hope that you have a wonderful week and that you go out and have some great adventures, okay? Maybe even some ocean adventures, who knows? Bye.